Hey collective, this is the Empress here. I'm back with another message. This is a collective read. Okay, so take what resonates and leave the rest. Okay, so let's see what's going on. Oh, all right, Exennial. Feeling like it's hard to fit in, caught in the middle. Um, this is someone who's like in the middle, like maybe late 20s, early 30s. Okay. So, ooh, and millennial at the bottom. Somebody's salty. This millennial. So, somebody's a little older than somebody here. Somebody, this younger person is salty over someone's bay over someone's man or female okay so somebody's salty this could be for some of you a lot of people on my page are at least mid 20 and um you know between 25 i would say 28 and 35 okay this is kind of like the middle age i guess you would say um but we got a millennial Okay, this millennial is younger. Okay, but this person is salty, and it has something to do with somebody's bay, somebody's lover. Hmm, interesting. Okay, tell me more. Okay, somebody could be salty. This person could be salty because maybe you have a side hustle. You got a business. You got something going on. Um, you got something going on for yourself. Why they just Netflixing and chilling. Okay, they've been throwing shade. Over here throwing shade. High key shade at that. Okay, about talking mess about you and what you do on the side. Your side business, your money. They looking at your pockets. Okay, they looking at your money. Look at this. They looking at your money. Okay. Swerve. To change directions, not interested. To send for a loop, dodging someone, or to dismiss. Okay. So somebody, we got glow up and adulting. Okay. Somebody, maybe you guys change directions. Okay. You change directions. You change directions on this person. Like you did something different. You're doing something different. And this, <laughs> I feel like shaking my head. No words can do just a disappointment. Stupid move. So somebody's over here shaking their head. Shaking my head like, mm. Tell me more. High key. Something needs to be said out in the open, letting everyone know. Okay. Okay, I feel like this is you guys' energy, vibe, and woke. I feel like a lot of you may be into like your spirituality, you're meditating, you're doing things your way. You may, like I said, some of you may have a business or something that you do on the side, or you just, you know, you're good financially. Okay, I feel like maybe you made some changes. Okay, I feel like you made some changes. Oh, and somebody feels like you're bragging. You got a humble brag. It's like you you can't help that what you got going on and it's successful. I feel like you're humble about it. You're not being like you're not being a dick or or put or you know, not being over the top with it. Don't be obvious. Self promoting, disguise the brag. <laughs> Yeah, whatever you're bragging about, you deserve the right to brag about it. And it got this other person shook. Yeah, you got well played and yes. So you're getting likes, you're getting recognition. Okay? You're getting recognition in whatever it is that you're doing. Okay? I feel like some of y'all took a different direction. Can't even. Can't deal with the situation. Don't know what to say or do. Can't comprehend. Shaking my head. Wow. 
So there's a situation that you may just be like, look, I ain't even got time for that. Because this is what my focus is on. My focus is on this, okay? I got things to do. I got better things to do with my time, okay? But this person, this, here she goes, this millennial. This person wants to clap back so bad. And they want to clap back because this is you over here, blessed. And like I said, some of you are into your spiritual, like your spiritual side. You're a vibe right now. And here comes the trolls on the internet, okay? And they are upset because you may be an influencer, okay? They're trying to gather receipts. They're on the internet taking screenshots, okay? This person could be trying to go viral, okay? They feel like you you over here flexing. But maybe some of you guys' relationship or somebody that they're dealing with, this could be like... Somebody that you're dealing with, you used to deal with, and now they have someone new or something like that. Because we got a relationship is flatlined. Okay. So there was some type of ending. But it looks like whatever ending, it looks like you're not being affected by it. Okay. Because this person feels like you're over here flexing for the internet. And they're in their feelings about it. They mad because you're getting compliments. And this is their energy over here. Sis. Mm. You're over here slaying. Okay, you're over here slaying. Your point of view is valid. Okay. This person could follow you on, on Instagram, could follow you on whatever social media site, whatever. They're following you. Digitally observing a love interest, keeping tabs, staying connected, stalking. Yeah, this person is stalking the hell out of you. They're waiting for you to struggle. Waiting for you to go through some type of hardship. Okay? Because maybe you acting too bougie for them and they feel like, Cap, you lying. You're lying. <laughs> you're lying. There's no way you're doing that good. You're lying. So somebody feels like you're being fake. You're lying. And they're just upset because this is what... <laughs> you're getting compliments. You're getting gassed. People are like, yes, yes, yes. And they over here, sis. Mm. <laughs> I cannot. All right, so. Like I said, this has something to do with some trolls on the internet. They're looking at how blessed you are. I feel like some of y'all have joined the spiritual community. And you guys are doing something that. You and your purpose. I feel like you're on your purpose. And I feel like this person is just looking for you to mess up in some way, shape, or form. Okay? Maybe this could be your energy in the beginning. Okay? We got staycation. A vacation spent at home. Enjoying local attractions. Many vacations on a budget. Okay? But now this is you. You up there. On fleek. Pop now. Okay, someone that you were dealing with, maybe your ex could have possibly ghosted you. So they were looking for you to go down since this person ghosted you or the situation didn't work out. Yep, there was a situation, there was a connection that ended. Okay, and they're on the phone with their friends, spilling tea, they gossiping, talking about it. And these are little trolls. They're trolls. <laughs> They are trolls. But this is you. You up here flexing, honey. Because you got goals. And this person is over here spying. They're watching your every move. Copycat energy. They're watching your every move and taking notes. Okay? They're looking at your pictures. And they're just having fears. Like, oh my God. <laughs> They're texting their friends. They're texting all their friends, throwing in shade. But listen, baby, none of that don't matter. Y'all keep doing y'all, because obviously y'all got people over here shook. Y'all got some people over here shook. So let's see if we can find out who this person is, what their intentions and stuff are. Who is this person spying on the collective? Who is this person spying on my collective? Oh, now this jumped out. Whoever it is, they broke. 
they going through their own struggles. So why they sit them there worrying about you? We got change. So they feel like, yeah, somebody's going through some changes. And then we got despair. Whoever it is, they're out of work. They they aren't things aren't going good for them. Okay? It's it's a man. I feel like for some of you. We got a wealthy man. So someone was doing very well, but now they're going through a hardship. Somebody's going through a hardship. It's like the tables have turned. They're getting their karma. Mature man. I feel like for some of you, this is a man. This is a male. Could be someone that you have a child with. Maybe there we got a privileged lady here. It could be someone's baby mother. High honor. Yeah, you guys you guys have came a long way. Y'all have came a long way. They, this person left you for dead That type of energy And I feel like you guys are bossing up Okay This could be someone that you're married to Maybe separated from Maybe this is somebody's family A community of people They're sitting over here judging you Could be someone's mother Someone's grandmother as well This person thought that you were going to be stuck without them or stuck not being able to move forward. Nah, not going to happen. Not going to happen. Not going to happen. Not even. Tell me more about this person. Tell me more about this person. They're definitely spying on you. And this is what they're seeing. The Nine of Pentacles. <laughs> like you're doing so good. You're doing so good and this is them. Could be a king of pentacles, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn, but you're doing very well. You're getting a lot of recognition. You're being recognized, okay? And I feel like this is pissing this person off, okay? Could be a cancer, but this person threw you to the wolves, okay? And you came back, all right? You came back for sure, for sure. Like, your comeback is their karma, for sure. Your success is their karma. Judgment. This person could have judged you. Mm, Prejudged you. Somebody that you could have been in a relationship with. Maybe this was a sexual connection. It ended like that. Like this was an on again, off again relationship. And I feel like that chapter has closed and you guys are on to something new. You're putting effort and work into something else. Some of you are going back to school. I feel like some of you got new friends. Like, you're just you're just on to something new. And I feel like you just got lurkers. Like, they're just lurking because of the progress that you've made. Okay? I feel like a lot of you are making a hell of a lot of progress. Okay? And whoever this is, could be one person, could be multiple people. They can't stand it. Okay? They can't stand it. But y'all going to keep doing what you're doing, okay? Let them hate, okay? Let them hate. They in their feels, so we're going to pull out the in my feels, okay? Because <laughs> they still in their feelings. Let's see. Oh, this person is in nine of swords energy. This person is in nine of swords energy. This person could be like really fearful or they're having bad dreams. They're reminiscing. They're reminiscing. Okay. But there's something, some type of secret here. We got shh. Something's a big secret. Like what's the big secret? 
I guess that they're spying. This person really, really actually is love struck by you. Okay. <laughs> they get emotional. Maybe this was a really emotional connection. But their ego is too big. Their ego is in the way. Okay. Their ego is in the way. And I feel like they're holding back. They don't want you to know that they think about you because of this. Got a big ego. Such a huge ego. It is what it is. And this person is like crying. Crying. Okay, we got domesticated. They could be in another situation. Okay. But it's still thinking about you. We got anxiety, worry. This person is like thinking about you. For sure. They want to rush in. Yeah, because you're the divine, divine feminine. And they're sad over it. They're sad because you are winning. I told you. Victory. I told you. This person is sad because you have elevated without them. They didn't believe. They didn't believe in you. They didn't believe in your goals. They didn't believe in your vision. They didn't believe in. You. They didn't. And I feel like you're showing them otherwise. All right. So that's the message that I got for you guys. I hope this message was helpful. And if this message was helpful, guys, be sure to subscribe to the channel as well, guys. Um, check out my website. The information is in the drop box below. You can get 20% off your entire order today. As well, guys, be sure to, um, if you're interested in booking a personal, all of that information is in the drop box below as well. Okay? So until next time, ciao for now.